In this video, I'm going to show you how to use EverWeb's Live Photo widget. As you may know, you can create a live photo on your iPhone if you have an iPhone 6S or later, or an iPad that's 2017 or later. Live photos record one and a half seconds of sound and video before and after the photo is taken to create a live image. When you touch the image on your iPhone, the recorded snippet will play. If you've taken a live photo that you want to include on your web page, you'll need to take the following steps. First, make sure that you've synced the photos you want from your iPhone or iPad with the Photos app on your Mac. Next, select the photo you want to use in the Photos app on your Mac. From the menu, select File, Export Unmodified Original. This will create two files, an image file with a .jpg extension and a video file which has a .mov extension. With these two files exported, you can now use them in EverWeb. First, make sure that you've installed EverWeb 2.5 or higher if you haven't done so already. Next, open your website project file and go to the page where you want the live photo to be placed. From the Widgets tab, drag and drop the Live Photo widget onto your page and size and place where you would like it. With the Live Photo widget selected, use the widget settings to add the exported .jpg file as the image file and the exported .mov file as the video file. Once you've added these two files, you can use EverWeb's preview function to test your page before publishing. To see the live photo in action, just mouse over the live button in the top right hand corner of the image. 